curve, C has the equation 3 to the power of x plus 6y equals 3 over 2x times y squared. Find the exact value of dy by dx at the point on C with the coordinates 2, 3, giving your answer in the form a plus ln b over 8, where a and b are integers. So we need to differentiate. Now I can see at the moment that I can't rearrange this to make either y or x the subject. This is all a bit awkward. So I'm going to have to use implicit differentiation. So what that means is I'm going to differentiate everything on the left-hand side with respect to x. And then I'm going to differentiate everything on the right-hand side with respect to x. What that's going to mean then is I'm going to end up differentiating y terms with respect to x. Which is fine, I can do that because I can differentiate them with respect to y and then multiply that by dy by dx. So basically, whenever I differentiate a y term, multiply that by dy by dx. So let's, let's do this then. So let's first of all differentiate the 3 to the power of x. 3 to the power of x, when I differentiate that, will give me 3 to the power x ln 3. Now I need to differentiate the 6y. So this is one of those instances. I'm, div I'm differentiating a y term. So differentiating 6y gives me 6, but I need to multiply by dy by dx because I differentiated a y term. Now, right-hand side, I need to be careful because I've got a product here. I've got the 3 over 2x and I've got the y squared. So I'm going to have to use the product rule for this. So let's let u be 3 over 2x. And we'll let v be y squared. Differentiating the u, that's nice and simple. 3 over 2x will differentiate to be 3 over 2. The y term, I need to be a bit careful with this because again, I'm differentiating a y. So we'll differentiate that normally and get 2y. But I need to multiply that by dy by dx. Now applying the product rule, I'll get u dashed times v plus v dash times u. Right, I need to find the exact value of this expression at the coordinates 2, Three. So um, at this stage, I'm going to substitute the 2 and the 3 in, and then I'm going to try and rearrange to get dy by dx looking like this. So x is 2, y is 3. So I'll get 3 to the power 2, ln 3 plus 6 dy by dx equals 3 over 2 times 3 squared plus 2 times 3 dy by dx times 3 over 2 times 2. We can do a load of simplification here because the 3 squared is 9. Over on the right hand side the 3 squared is 9 times 3 over 2 so that's 27 over 2 plus the 2 times 3 is 6. The, the half and the 2 here will cancel out. So the 2 times 3 is 6 times 3 is 18. So we get 18 dy by dx. Let me move the dy's by dx's all onto one side here. Because remember, that's the value that I'm trying to actually find here. So we get 9 ln 3 minus 27 over 2 equals 12 dy by dx. The 18 dy by dx 
minus the 6 dy by dx is 12 dy by dx. If we now divide both sides by 12, it's going to give myself a little bit more room. So dividing both sides by 12, we'll get 9 ln 3 minus 27 over 2. Now you can see here, we can simplify this a little bit. We don't like that awkward fraction there. Let's times the top by two. Let's times the bottom by two, just to get rid of this awkward thing. So we'll get 18 ln three minus 27, all over 24. Which I could simplify that down a bit because I can divide top and bottom by three here. All of these terms divide by 3 nicely. So I'll get 6 ln 3 minus 9 over 8. The last thing I need to do here, in fact, just to make this really clear, let me take my answer that I've got so far and compare it to what I needed to show. It's over 8, that matches up. I've got a constant term by itself that matches up. I've though got a 6 ln 3 and I just wanted ln b. So what I'm going to do is take that 6 and move it up using the power law. Because I can't have that 6 at the front. The question wants me just to have ln b. And I had 6 ln 3. So I can't have a coefficient in front of the ln. So by moving that up there, 3 to the power of 6 is 729. Now all of this matches up. Let's just compare. The 8's on the, the, eight's on the bottom. That matches up. The A is minus 9. And the B is 729. So that there is my final answer.